Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm going to show you guys how you can make your own sick visualizer. Just like that. that, 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 that. <laughs> Using an Arduino. So let's get started. In order to build the visualizer, you're gonna need an N-channel MOSFET. Uh, because you cannot directly connect the 12 volt LED strip to the Arduino. So we are going to use the MOSFET as a switch setup and connect the digital pin of the Arduino to the MOSFET's gate. And 12 volt LED strip and Arduino. I'm using Arduino Pro Mini but you can use any Arduino like Arduino Nano or Arduino Uno or etc. For programming the Arduino Pro Mini, you're gonna need an FTDI programmer. For receiving audio signals, we are going to use a microphone module that you can buy from Amazon or Flipkart. You are going to need a breadboard for assembling our parts. Also you are going to need a casing in order to make your project more practical and permanent. An external power supply. I don't have 12 volt power supply so I am using this 15.5 volt power supply but you can use 12 volts from a rectifier. Now let's just start with our build. I've connected the FTDI chip to the Pro Mini and now let's just add a fade sketch to the board. In order to test our setup, this fade sketch will send a PWM signal to the gate of the MOSFET. If our setup is working then we just need to add the microphone module and change the code a little bit. So let's just start building. Houston, we have a problem. The Pro Mini need an external voltage regulator when connected to an power supply greater than 5 volt, and I'm using 15.5 volts. Well, my Pro Mini is officially dead. I'm going to use Arduino Nano now because it have a voltage regulator inbuilt, which can withstand the 15.5 volt of my power supply. Okay, let's just add the Arduino Nano instead of Pro Mini to our setup and let's see our setup works or not. Time for test run now. Okay, um, yay, it's working. Alright, now what we are going to do is we are going to add the microphone module to our setup and change the code a little bit. Okay, I have the microphone module and now I'm going to add this to the setup.
and as you can see it's working. The microphone receive audio signals and the MOSFET get high or low according to these audio signals. And that's how our LED strip is fading according to the sound received by the microphone. I'm going to upload the second part of this video soon in which I'm going to put all these parts together and place it in that casing that I've just shown you. Till then stay tuned. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If yes, leave a like or a comment and I will see you next time. Bye bye. Peace out.